Here's the old building that once housed a well-known and very popular seafood restaurant in Gentilly. Take a look right here. It's been demolished. The city tore down the old Vasquez seafood restaurant, blighted for a decade. The place on Franklin Avenue in Fillmore has a lot of history, both good and bad. The wrecking crews went to work on the long abandoned building. <laughs> Unnecessary and overdue move, says Mayor Latoya Cantrell. Here it is, demolition by neglect, because this community doesn't deserve blight to just sit and remain. But what was once here was great decades ago. This is a place, look. You will come get your fish on Fridays. The old Vasquez seafood. Vasquez has played a major role in this community literally for decades. Serving people delicious seafood at a family owned business. But in 2003, tragedy struck. The co-owner Jose Vasquez was stabbed to death in the kitchen. Cops called it a robbery gone bad and arrested a man named Tyrone Wells. Then, just over two years later, in 2005, Hurricane Katrina came ashore, devastating New Orleans and parts of Gentilly. Just blocks away from the London Avenue canal break, the business flooded. When the water finally went down, the restaurant never reopened in Gentilly and relocated to Mandeville. As for the murder case, Wells went to trial in 2007, but a mistrial was declared. He then stood trial for murder in late 2009. Wells' defense was that he and Vasquez were in a relationship and he stabbed Vasquez in self-defense, but a jury didn't buy that and Wells was convicted. He's currently serving a life sentence at Angola. Now the place that holds so many memories for people in this part of the city is no more.